Hello, my name is Shellshocked and welcome to my Let's Play for Farming Simulator 19. So here a few months ago, uh, my wife and I were talking about getting out of the city and uh, maybe enjoying some of the country life. Uh, kids are all grown and uh, not much going on and instead of staying in the city we thought it'd be fun to uh, go out into the country so we uh, cashed in some of our investments uh, sold our house in town and uh, bought some uh, property out here uh, on Mercury Farm uh, there was an auction uh, here a few weeks ago and uh, this farm was part of the auction and we bought the whole thing so we are gonna take uh, a shot at farming and see how it goes so we've got a lot going on here and uh, if we take a look at the map, uh, we can see everything that was purchased in the auction. So it looks like we've got uh, about four, uh, nope, five different pieces of land here. Uh, not sure what's all on it, but here in this episode, we are going to take a look and see what we've got to start with. So uh, I think we're here at the first entrance and this is the driveway. Uh, this should be the main property up here, so we're going to just run up the driveway and see what we have here. Looks like we've got a couple fields on both sides, although I don't think we own either one of these. Uh, but here is the main farm, so uh, let's see, let's start over here on the left. Uh, looks like uh, we've got some a truck here, uh, a little chicken feed that was left in it. Uh, the Property did come with some equipment, and we're going to be checking that out to uh, see what we have available. Uh, some of it we might sell and see about getting newer or upgraded equipment. Uh, others we may keep for a while. Uh, with all the money that we had available and after the auction, uh, we have about $100,000 left. So we've got a little bit of a cushion to buy some uh, additional equipment, but we may also take out some contracts and... Uh, do some work on the uh, side to make a little extra money. So let's take a look here. So, ooh, uh, the house here looking a little rough. Uh, boy, it looks like they were trying to either, I don't know, fix it or tear it down. Uh, a lot of ivy on the walls, some trash over here. Let's take a look around back. Uh, well, they didn't even bother taking down some of their laundry and I don't think we're going to be keeping that, so that's probably all going to go away. Uh, windows are boarded up here on the back of the house. Uh, what do we got here? More trash. Oh, and a mattress. Oh, mattresses. Those things can get so nasty, so that's definitely going away too. So uh, here's the sold sign. That is us, but uh, I think now we are going to be able to move in and uh, let me turn on our help menu here there we go okay so we can see clean up and move in if we come right here so i know my wife is uh anxious to uh get our stuff moved into the house uh we've been living uh out of a hotel for the last couple weeks while we've been waiting for the sale to go through so uh, let's hear and see what happens Oh, there we go. Boy, this is cleaning up nicely. Oh, looky here. Let's take a look here. Oh, nice new windows here. Little bench. If we go up to the door here, uh, looks like we can sleep, but it looks like I'm not tired at the moment. Uh, did everything get cleaned up? Yep, none of this trash here. Uh, a couple of milk bottles there. Up oh, and they forgot to take the laundry down, so we'll have to see about uh, getting rid of that. Uh, yard's looking good here, nice little shed here, probably put some tools in there. Oh, and that mattress is gone, that's really good. I did not want that mattress to be uh, stuck here. All right, so it looks like we've got our house sorted out. Uh, let's take a look and see what else we have here on the main property. So let's start with this building here. Okay, got a door, let's open it. Ah, silos. So it looks like this is gonna be the place where we can keep our crops. 
Uh, let's open this door. Oh, this is kind of nice. A little bit of a drive-through silo here. Uh, nothing out the back side. I've noticed here around here there's a lot of hedge going on, a lot of weeds and stuff. And, you know, that's probably something that we're going to do. We're going to try and maybe clean this place up, make it look a little bit better. Uh, that's where you get your stuff out of the silo. See, more weeds and hedge here on the back side of this building. Let's see. Let's go around here and see what's in here. Ah! Okay, harvester. Got our header. Got our harvester here. Let's jump in. The Rostel, Rostel Mash 330. Uh, let's see. Let's start this up, see what it sounds like. All right, not bad. That's pretty good here. Uh, but, oh, wow, looks like it needs a lot of repair. Uh, the auctioneer kind of told us that most of the equipment was uh, in pretty bad shape and we're probably going to need some uh, repair on it. So uh, we get ourselves a little workshop. We'll try and uh, fix some of that up. But a uh, little header here. Uh, what's this? Oh, look, we've got some lights. Oh, lights come on. That's, that's nice. Turn those off. All right, let's see what's in this building here. Ah, okay, our first little tractor. Uh, looks like we got a cedar of some sort, an Amazon D830 Super. All right, let's take a look at this tractor. What do we got here? Okay, the Valtra N34. And looks like it starts. Uh, let's, let's pull this thing out here. There we go. Not too bad. Yep, we can see that it needs a good bit of repair. Okay, not bad. Don't know if we'll keep this one or not, but let's uh, get it out here. Not too bad. All right, let's look over here. What's next to the house? All right, uh, let's see. This yellow one, I think this is a fuel transport here, a fuel trailer. Uh, not sure how much we'll need of that here may just be easier to run to the gas station it might be something that we uh, trade in so we can get some money back for newer equipment and uh, then we got a joskin uh, water tanker i believe uh, nice little size this uh, will probably be handy might keep this uh, i'd like to get some animals here i think uh, the missus loves animals uh, we'll get some, maybe some sheep or some cows pigs possibly so that might come in handy I uh, got a trailer, a bucket, front loader there. That's nice. That'll probably come in handy. Uh, what's in here? Okay, uh, another uh, tractor and a uh, cultivator, subsoiler of some sort. Not sure about that. We'll take a look. All right, uh, how about this one? This is a case, IH Puma. Oh, okay, it starts. That's nice. Uh, as expected, looks like it needs a bit of repair too. But it's running and driving around, so I think we're in good shape. May have to see which one of these we may want to keep or sell. But for now, we're just going to park it right next to it. Not bad. Boy, they're awful dirty. These things definitely need a good bath, don't they? All right, let's see, what do we have over here? Couple buildings, looks like we've got some fertilizer, uh, maybe some herbicide up oh, there's the herbicide over here. Probably get some seed, so boy, this will be nice and convenient when we're uh, ready to do some work out in the fields. Uh, won't have to go to the uh, shop, we can just get everything right here. And uh, okay, one more tractor. Okay, I think they said there was three tractors. Uh, looks like this is a little Fiat here, 1300 DT. Don't know why it's over here in the weeds. I mean, it does start, sounds a little rough, but it's moving. I think this thing here is kind of old. 249 hours on it. You know, this is probably definitely going to be something that we're going to uh, trade in. I'm not sure I want to keep that. Not sure I really need three tractors at the moment. All right, anything else over here? Uh, let's see, I think this field here is something else that we own. Uh, let's take a look here. Yep, owned by me. Got some barley in it. 
it's growing. That's nice. Needs some plowing, needs a little lime. So that's some work that we're going to do uh, pretty quickly, I believe. But that's nice that there's already a crop in it. And I think we also own this field over here. Now, let's see. Let's hop over the fence. Whoop. All right. Yep. I uh, own this one, too. This has got some wheat. Oh, and it's ready to harvest. Ooh, so uh, let's see. Maybe we'll come over here, jump the fence, and uh, grab our harvester. And it may be one of the first things we do. Uh, we can probably make a little money off of it, uh, get us some extra cash, again, for upgrading uh, some of our equipment. Uh, but before we start that, uh, let's jump in this old truck here and let's go take a look at some of the other properties and see what else that we have purchased. So, let's see here. Let's, uh, let's go out back here to the main road and we'll head over to some of the other properties. Well, this truck doesn't seem to be a bad, an old Toyota. Let's jump on the road here. Yeah, I think we're going to enjoy this. This nice little countryside here. I think that's the, the spinnery there. If we get some sheep, I think that's a place where we can sell our wool. Lots of trees out here. Uh, I think it may be possible for us to do some forestry. All right, and uh, let's see, what do we have here? Okay, so this uh, this is the shop. This is the store. I think we can purchase new equipment in here. Uh, let's jump out. Let's see, let's go inside here. And yep, well, hello there. Uh, nope, not looking to buy anything right now, but uh, let's see. Yep, here's where we got our vehicles, tools, objects. So this is going to be where we come to buy everything. Let's jump back in here. A lizard pickup, 1978. All right, so let's move on to the next property here. All right, now I think if we just come out here onto the main road, and I think this is one of our properties also. Uh, let's see here. Let's jump out here, take a look. Yep, Mercury Hillside Farm. Okay, so the Hillside Farm. Wonder what is up here. Let's go up the drive and take a look. Okay, uh, looks like we've got uh, a couple sheds here, another house. Uh, let's jump out here. Is there anything inside this? Uh, nothing parked there. Open the doors. Nope, but uh, be a good place for some storage. Maybe put some vehicles up here. I think we've got another silo right here. Yep, yep, another silo. That's nice. And then more fertilizer, more seeds, more herbicide. Nice, convenient place for it. Not much going on here. Maybe this might be a place we could rent out. See if someone wants this property, make a little uh, rental income on it. But I'm just going to drive through here. And I think if I remember correctly, we can go up this path here to get to the next property. Uh, we don't own any of these fields on either side. Uh, maybe something that we could purchase. All right, let's run up this path here. Yeah, I'm really excited about this. So it's something different, something new I've always wanted to do. And I think we're going to maybe try our hand at a little bit of everything. But what did that sign say back there? Let's take a look. Uh... Mercury Poultry Farm. Okay, so this must be where the chickens are at. I heard that there was a place for all the animals. 
So this is where the chickens are. Oh, nice little bungalow house there. That's nice. Uh, maybe again, something we can rent out. Uh, all right, let's uh, let's turn the truck off here. Hop out. And yep, we've got uh, some chicken stuff here. Another chicken pan. Oh, this is nice. We've got three different uh, pens to deal with. And anything in this one here? Nope, nope, that's empty. So no more equipment up here. Uh, kind of a mess here. I have to come and clean that up at some time. Uh, nice shed over here. Plenty of room for equipment. So might be convenient that if we're going to have chickens here, some of the equipment we need to uh, support them and take care of them, maybe something that we will uh, just leave the equipment here so we don't have to drive back and forth. All right, let's uh, move on to the next property. Ooh, look at these windmills. Ah, these are cool up here. Oh, listen to that. You can hear them grinding. Man, what great special effects here. This farm is awesome. All right, so let's continue on here to our other property. A little spread out, but not too bad. It's easy enough. We've got these nice little dirt roads to be able to get around from one property to another. Definitely giving us plenty to do. I like how all the fields are kind of lined off with this fence. Wish so many of them didn't have all the hedge and weeds in it, but that's something that we can clean up and, and deal with. All right, uh, let's see here. I think this is, ah, this is a, where a lot of the uh, pigs and sheep and I believe uh, cows are kept. So it looks like we got one pen here. See a couple little huts, a lot of mud back there. I bet this is for the pigs. Um, no, that's a little silo back here. Another place to store some of the food that we need for all of these animals that we could be getting. Uh, what do we got back here? Nice little fence, down trees. Got a few logs on the ground. Kind of a messy back here. This is, again, another area we need to, to clean up. Uh, what's this? Ah, oh, look at that. A little stump grinder out here in the middle of the field. Looks like they kind of stopped in mid-progress here. They hadn't done that stump. They just kind of decided, well, we're done. Let's unhook this thing and just leave it right here. So uh, that's nice to know. Not sure if I'll need one of these right away. Uh, we'll kind of take a look at that. Uh, maybe something else that we'll get rid of and uh, use the money to buy uh, newer and better equipment. All right, so yeah, I think that's the, the pigs there. So let's take a look over here. Uh, what do we got here? Is this storage? Uh, oh, nope. This is where you work with your cows. Let's see, I bet this is uh, cows here, maybe? Hmm. What do we have here? Open the animal diet. Oh, nope, this is the sheep over here. Sheep, $1,500 a piece. Uh, but they make some wool, so that would be nice. We can use the wool and sell it at the spinnery. And let's hop over here. Uh, what do we got here? Uh, oh, a silo bunker. Oh, good. So if we want to make some uh, silage so we can make TMR, uh, someone had told me that the, the TMR, the total mix ration, is what cows need. And so if, if that over there is the pigs and this is the sheep over here, then this must be the cows over here on this one. Yep, uh, okay. Let's see. I wonder if that's the slurry tank. Someone said that with cows, uh, the cows make manure. Maybe that goes there. 
and the and the slurry goes there. I'm not sure what slurry is. Sounds like cow spit, something like that. Who knows? Let's jump over here and yep, nice big pen for the cows. Uh, look at all that land in the back. I think our property line goes way back here, uh, where you see these trees and you can barely see the hedgerow back there. Uh, so maybe that's somewhere we can cut down some of those trees, make a nice, nice pasture land for some grass, because uh, we'll need that grass if we want to make some silage over here in the silo bunker. Uh, got some more storage, and oh, oh wow, look at those lights. Like that, how that's all lit up. That's really good. All right, so this is a nice area for animals we like that let's come over here and pop into the truck uh, i think we got one more place uh, let's see i think the only thing that we haven't seen here is the place for horses so let's go take a look here i think it's down this way got all this area here well, it looks like someone's been doing some forestry there. Nice rows of trees. Could be something that we could purchase and cut down those trees. Do a little forestry, making some money on lumber. You know, here's a nice little plot also. Uh, during the auction, I, I think this uh, could have been part of it, but we didn't buy this part of the property. But... Nice area here. Maybe we could buy that in the future. Put some equipment down over here. Uh, maybe if we do some forestry over there, it'd be a nice convenient spot to, to store some stuff. All right, let's see here. I think this is it right across the road here. Check the traffic. Nope, cement truck. A couple other vehicles coming. So you can sneak across after this white car here. Okay, let's see. What do we got here? Oh, little uh, arena for, I, I think you got to work your horses and train them a little bit, make them strong, uh, make some more valuable. Some nice little arena. You can get them some exercise. And if we come up further, what do we got here? Oh, well, that's a nice size house there. Not too bad. Again, maybe that's something that we can rent out, make a little extra money from. Uh, but over here is our horse paddock. Got the place for some food. Looks like there's a few stalls to keep some horses in. Oh, there's already a horse in there. Well, where did that come from? Do I own that horse? I don't think so. Uh, let's check out this nice little paddock. Animal dialogue. Nope. I don't own that horse. I wonder where he came from. This. Oh, why, hello. How are you? Oh. So you're just a neighbor and you just needed to take a break, didn't want your horse running off, so you put him in there real quick. Okay, well that's fine, hello. And all right, so I think that is everything. Those are all the properties that we own. Uh, we'll need to get more familiar with the town, uh, find out where all the, the stuff is for selling the milk that we could get from cows. Uh, we'll I think we passed the spinnery where the wool was at. We'll have to find out some of these other areas for, see what we can do for selling the lumber. There should be many ways for us to make some extra money here uh, while we're building and growing our farm. Uh, we'll definitely be working some fields not sure what kind of crops we'll do, but we might try a little bit of everything. And, you know, if we're going to get into animals, we'll definitely need to uh, have the, the feed available for them. Ooh, what's this over here? Well, let's take a quick look here. Oh, 
Okay, I just ran someone over. That's not a good start here. And oh, a nice little park. Got some tables. What's that say? The Wandering Grill. Oh, what do they got here? Looks like they might have some burgers, something, some hot dogs, something to drink. Nice. Nice little place to hang out. Oh, playground for the kids. That's nice. And what do we got? Nope, oh, little lake down here. Oh, this is nice. Nice little town. I think we'll like this. Grandkids can come visit and we'll have a place to take them. We'll love that. All right. So uh, that kind of gives us a tour of our property that we just purchased. Let's see, I think we can get home by going through this little field right here. Let's see, because I think that's it right up ahead of us. Let's take a look. Is this going to take us home? Yep, this should do it. Okay. We have made the loop. We are back here at our main house. Just parked the truck right there. So uh, I think we've got a good start. Good bit of equipment. Uh, we just need to kind of decide what equipment we're going to keep, what we're going to sell, uh, maybe figure out what we're going to work on, try and clean this place up, make it a little nicer. Uh, I understand that the, the previous owners uh, weren't keeping it up in, in good condition. Uh, I think they were an elderly couple and just finally decided that uh, it was time to give up the farm. Uh, but we are glad to have it. And so uh, I think we're going to end it here for this episode. So uh, thank you very much for joining us. Hope you enjoyed it. And if you have, please hit that like button. And if you really liked it and want to see more of this Let's Play, then uh, please hit the subscribe and you'll be notified when uh, we have another video out. So thanks for being here, and we'll see you next time.